Hello everyone and welcome to um, my channel. Um, I'm here today in my bathroom. Um, this is the best place that I have lighting to show you all the products that I've got. And stupid doors annoying me. There we go. Yeah, I no more closing doors. Anyway, um, so I'm here today to sh uh, show you my special Mimi box that I bought. I bought um, a special two for the uh, for really cheap price plus cheap. Postage, I can't remember, but anyway, this one is box number 29 and it's called um, Color Burst number two. Unfortunately, I've just hopped onto the bedwagon of Mimi boxes, only because I didn't have money the first time to do it. I found out about Mimi boxes when they just before they stopped taking it, um, posting it to um, at, um, internationally. It became a stage where they're like, no, nah, we're not doing it anymore internationally, we're just doing it um, in Korea, blah 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 and they realized how bad of a decision that was. So they started again. So I found out about them a little bit before. Anyway, so here's the box. It comes with the card and inside, quick pick, very quick pick, very quick pick, okay, that was very quick pick. All right, so I'm gonna go by the numbers of the card. So, so number one was the Hope Girl Tinted. Where are you, Hope Girl? I did have this in order and they've just somehow gotten out of order. What the heck? No. Okay, cool. So the first thing that I got was my Tinted Cushion Lipstick by Hope Girl. So it comes in a package like this. Mm -hmm. Let's open it up. Um, my colour is 03 per, um, Coral. What was it? Coral Pink, sorry. So that focuses. So that's Coral Pink. So I like the um, packaging to it. It's really cool really cool um this is the one thing that got me really confused it has like a buffer it's like a sponge at the tip of it and then on the other side you've got your lipstick so that's the color it is and apparently it's meant to this is meant to be like a lip gloss without the product so apparently you're meant to put it on so this is the color it's a very beautiful colour. Apparently I meant to put it on and then use this to make it into I don't know. I don't know, can you guys, all I can see is that it's blending it out more than anything else. I don't know. I I'm definitely I'm really if anyone knows how to use this, let me know. But I actually won't be using it because as you can see it's making it I don't know. I have a problem with that as well because um, once you start using that, you're going to end up having germs on it and it's bacteria is going to grow on it. So I'm not really happy with that unless you wash it every day. I'm not happy to use that. But I'm really happy with the colour. As I said, look look at how, just a little swipe. Look how pigmented that is. That's beautiful. I, I, this is a really nice colour. So there you go. So that's the Hope Girl. So that one retails for twelve dollars. So that's twelve dollars. So the next one I got was the Hope Girl Wonder Magic Mascara. So this is how it looks like, how it comes packaged. I like that print. That's a really awesome print. And I do, oh, I love this mascara's presentation. Look at this, guys. How cool is this mascara. I love it for its packaging alone. So, and this is the brush. To our, uh, I haven't used it yet, I haven't tried it out yet. But let's see how that goes. Not today. I will um, put a review up of them. I'm just unboxing these. Um, so this one's valued at $22. It's a full size. So that's pretty awesome. So that's two products. Number three. I was excited about this one. It is 
the Su Young Mi Mineral Essence in Liquid Foundation. That's what we got. Uh, made in Korea. There's not much. It has um, all Korean on this. It says on here that it's a hypoallergenic liquid type foundation enriched with various minerals and the patent cause 5 complex. This mineral essence in liquid foundation offers everything from high level of moisture and long lasting adherence to natural coverage and soothing effect and is suitable for all skin types. So it actually doesn't say what colour it is at all. Oh, am I showing you the cut? No. Um, it doesn't tell me what colour it is. I will look for it. Maybe it only comes in one colour. Um, I have no one shade. I have no idea. Um, this isn't, so this is the bottle. Pretty, I actually really like this bottle. Um, but there's no um, colour on it. Everything else is in Japanese or Korean. But apparently it's an SPF 33. So on this hand, I'll show you because I did try it yesterday. Yesterday, um, when I did one of my, I was trying to do the blog, um, but because it was too dark, I decided to do it again. So I'm just gonna put a little bit, just a little dot. See how much I've got on, and I'm just gonna put it. Let's put it on my chin. Put some more. Do you know what? I'm gonna grab some more. Normally, I'll put primer on first, but meh, couldn't be bothered today. Put it on my chin. I have no, no, I have no makeup on at the moment. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's actually really. What do you guys think? I really like this. Of course, it'll work a lot better if I had a brush on. Oh, not a brush on, but yeah, I'd use a brush for it. So I've only done up to here to here. Oops, put them on my mouth. What do you guys think? I think that's really good. And it doesn't, I, I, I put it on and it doesn't feel cakey at the moment. It doesn't, I don't, it doesn't even feel like I've got anything on right now. Feels like I've just put on some moisturiser on. That's really beautiful. So I'll, I'll do um, makeup with that one. But that's a really beautiful foundation. I'm really happy with that. Um, this one, I keep on putting it on the wrong way. Um, this one come across $34. So that's more than $50 there already. So 34, 44, 46, 46, $66 there on these three products. But wait, there's more. So the next one is called, uh, it's by Beautiful People. And you actually got two of them. You got two of them. Um, both together, uh, I think both together was $48, unless they're $48 separate, but I think they're $48 together. You got, um, you had, um, you were lucky enough to get four, two, you got two colours out of four different colours. So the first colour that I got, which is a beautiful colour, it is Diamond Beige. And last night, after I swatched it, I actually used my um, makeup remover stuff. And it was actually a little bit hard to get out. So you know that these are awesome, awesome, awesome eyeliners because it means that it will take a lot for it to come off. So it will be waterproof and if you cry, it wouldn't smudge, etc. So it actually didn't even smudge. So it was a bit hard to get off. I finally got it off. But even now, I can still see a little bit of glitter on my hand. <laughs> anyway, so I'm going to swatch it for you. So I'll put it um, in between. So that's really beautiful. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that colour. Absolutely beautiful. Um, and something that I've always... Um, the reason I've 
never liked these is because, well, at least with the lip pencils, you can sh sharpen them up and stuff, and eyeliner, you know, eyeliners and whatever. Um, you can actually, um, sorry, this is a gel eyeliner. Anyway, um, with the pencils and stuff, you can get to start sharpening it and sharpen it. But with these ones, they come blunt, etc. Um, so I've never really been a fan of these. But oh my god, look at this. Okay, it looks like a normal, 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 normal pencil. Oh my gosh, it actually comes with a sharpener. It sharpens up the tip for you. So I think that's pretty awesome. I think that's pretty cool. So they both have that. Um, so I thought that was a very clever idea. Um, I was really impressed with that. So that's the first colour I got. And now... This is the second the one that I got from Beauty People, which I said again was um, $48 for both together. Um, this one's a, called Diamond Bronze. So that's a, how it comes. Very pretty. And again, it has the sharpener at the, at the tip of it again, which I think is pretty awesome. And this is the colour to it. It's a nice darkish brown. So I can, I reckon I can do a um, awesome, what's her name, um, makeup look with just those two together. Make them into eyeshadows, just put them on, you know, smudge them out, etc. But look how beautiful those are. I like that. Um, beige one, the diamond beige. Look how sparkly that is. And mind you, I'm a matte lover. So I'm really impressed that I like that. But they're both beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Gel, and they're called gel eyeliners. So I'm really impressed with them. Um, so that's more than $100 right there. Woohoo! So 66 plus 48. Well, 60 plus 40 is 100. 8 plus 4. That's a hundred and twelve dollars. If my, if I can actually calculate properly, it's a hundred and twelve dollars there. But wait, there's more. The next thing that we've got is another Hope Girl product. Comes like that, and I fell in love with it. Um, I got color. I had, I had color on here. Oh wait, the main will be on there. Here. Yeah, um, I got um, color 01 Sexy Rose and it's a 3D powder blusher. And I like the first, the first thing I liked about it is, and I won't blind you so I put my fingers over it, but on the lid it has a little mirror. So that I see that's pretty cool. So that's big enough to even do your mascara on the go. You can just close your eye, one of your eyes, and do that or just. I actually like it. That's really cool. So for on the go, you know. Okay, so that's the first thing that I liked about it. So I'll show you the actual colour. So it comes. Try for it not to fall down. I don't want to. So it comes powdery. It's all loose. So that's the first thing to it. But that gold rim here, that's actually the buffer. Um. I'm not going to use it. I know I've got a little bit of product on there because I was kind of checking it out. But it actually has a stopper at the end of it. So I'm not going to be opening up that just yet because I've got other blushes I want to use first. And then once I'm ready to do that. So, so I think the whole idea is you unblock that section, put that on, and then you just wipe it on. So I think that's a pretty clever idea. Um, I really like, I think that's really cute, this little sponge. So I'll see how that goes. So this one is retailed for $18. That's for $80. So that's $122, $130 right there. But wait, there's more. The next one, um, next thing I have, second last thing I have is the Cat Girl Waterproof Pen Liner. So I really like the packaging. I like the girl. How cute is that girl? with a cat. Meow. So I'm guessing it's meant to be Cat Girl because the Cat Girl brand. Oops, oops, I put it on the wrong way. Okay, 
So this colour I got was just 01 black. So I wonder if everyone got black or if some people got random colours. Um, so that's what it looks like. And I really love the tip to this. It is very, very, I don't know if you guys can see how fine that is, but that's a really fine tip. Um, and I played around with it yesterday, so I can do really thin lines, so that's just one go. See how thin that is, that line? You can do really thick lines. And I even went ahead and was playing around with it and... So there, that's all in one stroke. Can you see how fine that is? I actually really like it. That was only with one sweep. So I'm really, really impressed with this. With this cat girl. Cat girl eyeliner. Waterproof pen liner. And this one um, retails for $17. So $17. So that's $147 right there. So... Already, and that's just one box out of two boxes that I got, so I'm really happy with it. And the next thing that I got, um, which I didn't open last night and I don't want to open, um, is called the Close Up. Close Up YET. Oh, uh, sorry, no, this is a. Um, oh, no, sorry, my bad, I read this wrong. This one here is $9, and this one here is the. $17 one. So $47, dollars so $56 altogether for this. Anyway, uh, so this one's the um, $17 one. This one is the Lady Kin Close Up Decouple Fitting Powder. I'm still not 100% sure what the powder is. Apparently, you, um, you'd have, you, there was a random selection of number 21, 23, and 33. But unfortunately, this actually doesn't say... I've looked everywhere for it, even when I turned off um, the the thing yesterday, the, the camera, and I went to bed, well, before I went to bed, I kept on looking everywhere for it, but I can't find what colour it is. It doesn't say what colour it is. There's nothing there. I've looked... So, there's nothing that actually tells me what colour this is. So, even if I wanted to buy it again, after I've tried it out, I have no idea what colour to buy. So, um, that's a bit disappointing, Mimi Box. I'm sorry, but... It may... Well, it's not even Mimi Box's fault. Um, it's actually the um, Lady Kin close-up decouple fitting powder people. Um, but I'm pretty happy with the box. Um, as I said, I'm not too sure what this... I want to still research that. If anyone knows you know, what this is, how to use it, um, let me know. I don't know if it's a foundation, because it if it was a foundation, foundation, one day top, because it looks like a foundation, it's a beige colour. I don't know. Let me know. Right down the bottom and let me know. Okay, so that's the Mimi box part of it. Um, I did get the other box, which I'll quickly show you. I won't, um... If you want me to do a review on it, let me know. I'll actually maybe at the end, uh, what I'll do is I'll take photos. Uh, I'll, I'll, no, I won't, I won't take photos. I'll just show you guys that I've got with it. I've got the, for my partner, Mimi Box for Men number two. I got that. Um, and with it, it came um, with seven products as well. So I'll just go through it really quickly. So we've got the card there. Um, so number one was uh, Neo Pour Homme Aftershave. It was an actual sample pack. It wasn't a full size. That's normally the full size product. Oh no, apparently it was a full size product. It didn't look like a full size product for me. No, it wasn't a full size product. I'm pretty sure it wasn't a full size product. Let's have a look. No, it wasn't. Ah. Um, the full size product for it is a hun uh, $34 for 140ml. We didn't get that full size. There was only a sample. Um, then we've got the uh, CC cream. 
for men that's uh, 40 mils and that's worth $21 so that's all on there then he got um, a whitening essence mask which um, whitens the pan and enhances the skin then he got a relief first peeling gel pouch it's a sample so it came with like that sample um, and the full size is normally $21 but we didn't get a full size also with the whitening mask it was $22 for just one and we got one of them and then at the back we got um, Perderm by Men Essence Mask for Men we got three of them so normally a set of five would be $13 that's that one um, so yeah then we got a Forest Story Super Hard Water Spray so what that one is is actually for your hair. My partner doesn't have hair on his head, so he actually used the uh, used it for his goatee. Wasn't too sure about. It. He liked how it moisturised it and kept it um, out of, in place, um, but he wasn't still too sure about. It. He's going to give it a couple of tries, and then he got a pore control essence, which um, that one retails for forty six dollars, and with the um, water uh, the Hair one, it came to seven dollars. That one, so I think out of all of them, because he's had a look at them, he he liked the poor, poor one. He liked the mask, he wants to try the mask. He was iffy about the um, the CC cream, we're not too sure if he's going to be using a CC cream. Um, um, he liked the forest story so far, which is the one for his hair, for his goatee, he'll be trying it out a little bit more and he's willing to try the mask oh, the only thing that we were disappointed of was the aftershave we love the smell, he loved the smell of the aftershave um, but unfortunately because it's a small pack that kind of bumped us out I don't understand why they put an aftershave as a sample rather than a full product but there you go um that's my review on both mimi boxes i hope you have a good evening if you like my new way setup of the cat of the camera that i'm using let me know on the details below um yeah so have a lovely night and thank you for watching bye